Was that too loud, by the way? The last section. Who are you? Awesome. Okay. Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. Um, Jericho? This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. Free? And hiding just to stay alive. That's freedom to you? Humans hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. If humans knew we were here, they'd kill us. Um, trail? And you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you could decipher the signs, it's because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho! I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. Um... Somber. Maybe I was never really free. Maybe I was only what my master wanted me to be. And now, I need to decide who I really am. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Settle in. Right, okay. Um, I, I have Tron, but not for a long time. Not for another long, uh, not for a really long time. North, you ha you don't ha you don't like North, Mel. <laughs> Got two favorite scenes in Detroit that kind of touch me emotionally. Right. Okay, lots of things to look at here. Tons of things to look at. I thought of a really bad joke there. <laughs> really inappropriate. But um, I, I feel like that would be a good advert for like energizer batteries. Like this is what happens if you don't use energizer batteries. Do you want this to happen? No. Buy energizer. <laughs> most Marcus chapter. You find most Marcus chapters a little boring. I mean, they're slower. It's much more sort of like... I mean, yeah, Connor's seems to be all about action, doesn't it? Yeah, the Energizer bunny just hops into the picture. Yeah. <laughs> I'll cut shit. I kind of want to do it now. I kind of want to do that. No, not naughty. Not naughty sketch, no. No, just kind of inappropriate. Uh, for the for the for the mood. Right. Is that where Lucy is? I want to want to try and explore first if I can. Can we talk to everyone? No. Nope. <clears throat> where they have kid androids? Have we seen one of those yet? 
Or is it a dead kid? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. Oh, okay. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. Do we get something if we light all the fires? Oh god, what well, if you like just light all the fires and like you, you burn the Jericho down somehow? <laughs> That'd be just my luck. So you still got more RA9 stuff. Is it gonna be is it gonna be like the basically the the like the Jesus of the Android world? And is it gonna end up being Marcus or something? Nitron, have a good one, man. Thanks for trolling. <laughs> nah, have a good one, dude. Jendi, hello. Welcome to the stream. It's uh, it's good to meet you. What else we got? Wow, there's tons of stuff in here. I take it you've played this before, Jendi, right? talk to her north oh your favorite mel um you what was your function before coming here what do you care oh okay uh wounded a lot of these guys in pretty bad shape that's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. We'll never accept what we are. Uh, spare parts? Well, these guys need spare parts and blue blood. Why hasn't anybody gone to get that? It's not that simple. You can't just go shopping at a cyber life store. Anyway, nobody wants to risk leaving Jericho. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. I don't think she's happy, guys. It's, it's something like something tells me she's not not too happy. You've played it a lot, Jendi. I've uh, this is my first time playing it. Mo unfortunately doesn't like it. <laughs> Thanks, North. Please go to hell. Oh man, she's gonna do something like hideous, isn't she? Later, I've just got a feeling. Are you on your tenth playthrough? Do you are you finding you're getting different playthroughs each time? There's, there's. I keep missing these like last. Um, these like secret things you can find. Not me very good shape, am I? My diagnostic program isn't working. I don't think it would have anything good to say anyway. What happened to you? They tied me to the back of a car. I think they wanted to have fun. I don't want to shut down. No, I, I don't want to shut down. David Cage, we get it. Humans suck. <laughs> Man, they like why is it all why are all humans so horrible in this? Okay. Yeah, what's the last thing? 
So obviously we can go and talk to her. I don't know if it unlocks like when we... I'm just going to have one more quick look around. I don't know if it unlocks when we um, when we've talked to Lucy. Right now, forcing myself to choose all the triangle options. How's that going for you? All triangle options. That's kind of cool. Kind of an interesting way of doing it. I looked over there. You've watched four or five in every ending, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna try. I don't want to. I'm trying to do it like as I'm gonna. I'm trying to do all of my decisions based on like what I think is best uh, thing to do, even though that might be the wrong, wrong thing, totally wrong thing to do. Yeah, Detroit, please don't become human because they suck. Yeah, they they had that title originally, but it didn't like quite flow off the tongue quite as well, did it? Uh, not bad so far. I did the same thing with Circle, and it went really well for a while, and then everything blew up in your face at the end. Yeah, I could see it not working forever. I think the problem with David Cage's writing, Mo, is because he's not like he's not subtle at all, like even one little bit. She missing half the back of her head. Are you Lucy? Sit down. I appreciate the lurk, by the way, Mo. Show me. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Can't even lift the shirt up. I'll stop the bleeding. Drink this. I feel like we should have given that to someone else, but... You had it all, and you lost it all. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. That really doesn't look right, does it? It looks, uh, looks strange. It's because it looks so realistic as well. Uh, do I have a favourite yet? What favourite character, Jendi? Also, Ark, what's up, dude? Good to see you. I felt failed to lift the shirt, Ikea. Yes, I did. Uh, have I placed close to the sun yet? No. How's it going, Ikea? I know they're literally child androids dying all over here, uh, but here, drink this entire bottle of Therium to heal your little paper cut on your side. Yeah, exactly. That's what I mean. I was kind of like half thinking, like, should I just wait and then not? But. <laughs> wow. That was a good, that's a good one. Reese, Jendi's, uh, Jendi's going to give you a run for your money here with that pun. That is a really good pun. Don't make fun of Lucy. She's just very open-minded. <laughs> I like it. 
It's a horror adventure. Um, I don't... Oh, no, yes, no, I have seen that. That's the one that looks kind of like Bioshocky, doesn't it? But it's on a ship, right? I got a quick look at that um, a couple of months ago, back at an indie thing. Yeah, it looks really cool. Uh, who's my favourite? I... Um... I'm going to have to go for the um, like basic bitch route here and uh, go for Connor at the moment if we're going for the three androids. I think Connor, Kara, Marcus in that order. Okay, good. <laughs> that Connor's everyone's favourite, it seems, but I can see why. I can totally see why. Simon. <laughs> yeah, insert Connor wink. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife warehouses in the Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Maybe it's worth a try. Okay. I'm in. Mel Mel's like secretly hoping that ah oh, oh, I hope North gets killed. <laughs> uh okay, it wasn't wasn't really anything to fuck up there then. Apart from just missing certain people to talk to. Alright. Alright. Let's keep going. 